Science Central. If you've spent much time online, chances are you've been required to solve distorted letter puzzles like this when you submit information. It's an anti-spam program called CAPTCHA. As soon as Yahoo started using it, every other website started using it, and it really turns out to be extremely effective at stopping uh, spam. Co-inventor Luis Von Ahn says it's effective because only people, not computers, can figure it out. At first, he felt proud of its impact. But then I started feeling bad because the thing is, each time you type a CAPTCHA, essentially you waste 10 seconds of your time. And if you multiply that by 200 million, you get that humanity as a whole is wasting like 500,000 hours every day typing these annoying CAPTCHAs. But he was also aware of another problem. Some libraries use computers and scanners to transcribe old books and newspapers into digital archives. The problem is that letters often look murky, so computers often transcribe words incorrectly. The reason the computer cannot decipher many of the, of the words is precisely the same reason why computers cannot read CAPTCHAs. It's because they cannot read distorted text. But since people were already decoding distorted text, Von Ahn revised CAPTCHA to use the hard-to-read text from old books as the puzzle. He estimates 20 million words a day are digitized with the new program he calls reCAPTCHA. People are usually very happy about this. They, they say that, well, at least my time, you know, these things are annoying, but at least my time is not wasted anymore. So feel good next time you have to solve one of those word problems. You might be helping to preserve a part of history. Sunita Reed, Science Central News. Thank you.